I am an aspiring bodybuilder. Um, I'm a co-owner of Workhorse Apparel. Um, I have certifications through the International Sports Science Association uh, for fitness and nutrition and also for personal training. Big into sports. I actually went through a breakup in college and looked myself in the mirror I think like the next day and was like, wow, uh, I'm really out of shape and I need to get into shape. <laughs> and um, Evan, my buddy Evan, Matt were working out at the gym and they invited me along. So I started going and kind of just fell in love with it. Uh, I now want to become a professional bodybuilder. I know that's what a lot of guys say, but just start starting from where I began of being a 300 pound plus overweight guy in college, uh, I think stepping on stage and earning something like a pro card would be an unbelievable accomplishment. How would you describe workhorse apparel? Gritty. What does it mean to you? Gritty. Uh, it means everything to me. It's the one thing that I've really had that's been I could something I can really put a lot into, um, and something that. It's something that I really want to see succeed. Um, I've honestly not had a lot of triumphs uh, in my life, and now having something that I can put 120% into and try to start or try to take from the ground and make it into something huge, I think, would be a great accomplishment. What kind of goals do you have to become a well-known, well-liked apparel company that people want to own? Just take every opportunity and maximize every little bit that you get. You are not going to get a lot of opportunities and you have to take the one, take every single one and make the best that you can out of it. You have to take every little scrap, every little bit, and just say, I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna make the most out of it. So if I could say anything, it's just don't take anything for granted and just bust your ass, simple as that. And make, if you don't have something, make it, what, whatever you're missing, take what you got and make it. Just make it. Failure. Um, failure motivates me. Um, it's not that I dislike failure because in the bodybuilding world, failure is a good thing. Uh, muscle failure is a good thing. Um, but failure has always been the biggest motivator because I do want to be successful. Um, I want to be well known, and that's not an ego thing. It's just, that's just what I want. Um, I'd love to be a well-known entrepreneur, a well-known bodybuilder, just a well-known person and a well-liked person as well.